Hey everybody, this is Tim Biota. I'm coming at you with another third party Transformers review. This time we have TFC Toys Uranus F15 Eagle. And check out the box in the front. We have um, an artist rendition of F15 Eagle. And on the side we have the full bodied picture. And on the back we have F15 Eagle in his robot in his vehicle mode, his jet mode, and then in his combiner limb mode. And on the side you'll see a, a wireframe rendition of him in in robot mode. And on the top you also see the wireframe rendition of him in his aircraft mode. And on the bottom also his aircraft and then some warning. Alright, well Let's get this thing open and check them out. All right, and here we have F-15 Eagle out of the box and in his jet mode. And as you can see, the foot for his combiner mode does double as a little flight stand. Um, all I need to do to attach it or detach it is just, just kind of pry apart these the landing gears like this, and then it'll just come right out, and it just attaches by this little peg right here into the hole right here. Right, let's set that aside. And, and take a look at the jet mode. All right. and from the front and from the sides and the rear. And then the top and then you can see the undercarriage. All right, some of the features that he has while he's in jet mode is that his cockpit does open like that. And you can open his nose cone to reveal a little sensor. Close that up. And then also, it's mainly because of transformation, but he does, you can lift up his air brakes. Alright. Does have landing gear. And these are long enough to have clearance so that nothing drags unlike the F4 Phantom. So go ahead and start the transformation. All right. First thing we'll do is remove the missiles. Kind of look like some kind of drone missile. So I'll take these, put these off to the side. Alright, we'll detach the arms from the side. And then go ahead and Pull the wing back just a little bit and then we'll grab the legs and go ahead and pull those out. A nice click. And pull the feet down, twist them around. Pull the other foot down and twist it around. And then what we'll do is come back here. Can't grab this. Grab the little air brake. All right, there you go. And flip up the thruster. There you go. Flip up the thruster. Just kind of fold those fins back. All right. Now that I have that done, go ahead and focus on the arms. Flip the intakes back a little bit. Lift the shoulders up. Flip around the arms, lower them down, do the same for the other side. And then for the head, go ahead and take this and pop it back and fold it up. And then it kind of, you can push it in and kind of lock it into place. It is kind of wobbly, so what you can do to keep it from wobbling is you can take this little panel right here and flip it up. And that'll, that'll hold it into place. And then twist around the head. And then... It's all up to your preference whether you want to 
take and split these apart or if you just want to leave them like that uh, I generally like to split these apart just kind of hides them while he's in robot mode See? and then I generally take the wings kind of fold them up and then pitch them back like that Now we have F-15 Eagle in his robot mode. And now for his weapons, um, pull these little tabs out. And he can either hold them in his hands, like that. You can have one in each hand, kind of like this. Or you can do also do the under and over or you can attach them to to the side of his arm or <clears throat> like I like to do is I just like to put him up here and kinda have him hanging off over his shoulders Alright, and for his movement, he does have a ball joint in the head. He can move his shoulders up like that and out like that. He does have elbow joints. He doesn't have any kind of movement in his wrist, but at his hips, you can move his legs forward and back and out to the side. He does have a knee joint and a ball joint for his foot. Another little feature that I forgot to mention is that he does have missile pods on his chest. There's F-15 Eagle. Until next time, this is Tambiota. See you later.